Here they come. Complete. Once again, Jeremy Childs comes up with a first down reception. Jerome Boyd again putting the pressure on Kellen Moore getting a hit on. You know, and Kellen Moore, Tom, knew that he was going to get hit. Delivered a perfect strike and then turned and just let his pads take the blow. And look at that celebration. Third and 11 now. Moore in trouble. Gets it out to Childs, shy of the first down marker. Childs right back in the game after taking a tough hit from Chris Randall. And look at Moore buying time, throwing against the grain as a left-hander. That's a tough thing to do. Moore rolls, Watson let it go. Catch made by Childs over the middle. A great grab by Jeremy Child. Comes across the middle, just sort of sets down. What do the coaching staff tell us about Jeremy Turn Child? Out. Third and nine for Moore. And he just side arms it to Johnson. Oh, roll to the right for the lefty. He gets hit again. This time they don't hang on to him. But Pettis hangs on to the football. Wow, what a spectacular catch by the sophomore from Anaheim. It's a 19-yard pickup and another Boise State first down. He was actually covered. And this is a great <laughs> throw. A great throw and a great catch. You will see two guys in the area. Now watch Pettis 87. There he is, one underneath, one over the top. Look at that. That ball thrown over one defender and in front of the other, and Pettis goes up to right. get it. And the present right now as well. Back up to you guys. Kellen Moore going up top for Avery. God damn it. He's got it. Jeremy Avery at the 18. No. Sorry, Childs, Childs. Jeremy Childs at the 18. Look at Kellen Moore. So poised as the pocket's collapsing and a catch in double coverage. Triple Unbelievable. coverage. Unbelievable by Jeremy Childs. Jeremy Childs, this is the reason why he was. Uh, Johnson's in there now and he's pass protecting as Moore tries to throw him. He's on end zone, he's got Benny Pereira. Pereira's loose. Benny Pereira, close to midfield. Pereira, dragged down in TCU territory. A huge play for the Broncos. Pretty much a coach on the field because he's knows as much as Chris Peterson, according to Pete. Aaron at long. Titus Young. 20. 10. Touchdown, Broncos. Vinny Peretta is in the backfield, and Peretta, the starting wide receiver. A little trickeration here. Kellen Moore going deep and has his man complete. That's Chris O'Neill. Touchdown. Boy, oh boy, they always make it fun, don't the Broncos? 44 yards. And how about the way they set this up in the first quarter? Peretta carried the ball on the toss sweep two or three times. Now you have him with the throwback, and nice and cool, Kellen Moore finds his man out to the right side easily for the touchdown. This crowd has come to life. Peretta! He will walk into the end zone, the senior Vinny Peretta touchdown Broncos! the way you follow up an interception, Tommy. Wow. That time, Vinny Peretta started in the backfield, split out, was isolated on linebacker Casey Matthews. Matthews could not match the speed of Vinny Peretta, and it's a 75-yard touchdown. It's third and 24. Peretta down to the 32-yard line. Antoine Thompson saved the touchdown for the Wolfpack. Well, you can't say that Kellen Moore had great protection on that play. The Nevada rush went right past him. Dante Moat, he steps up into the pocket masterfully and uncorks a perfect strike to Vinnie Peretta. Perfect air under that ball. The senior from Encinitas, California, who had such a big game at the Fiesta Bowl, comes up big there with a 63-yard pass reception from the lefty Kellen Moore.